So Clabes became enamored with him, even though she knew she couldn't escape her deception, and that he'd eventually learn she was a spy. Oh well, once we have an endless supply of insane soldiers, there'll be no need to spy on Andantino. What about the one in Baroque? You mean Serenade? No, she's very dependable. And besides, her interests coincide with mine. What do you mean? Forte would be in a difficult position if we were to be attacked before we finished developing a more powerful mineral powder. Serenade's betrothal has made her a Baroque citizen, but she's still a princess of Forte. She's the perfect person to prevent Baroque from starting a war with us. She won't let them follow a path that could harm Forte. More importantly, Fugue should be busy searching a go-go forest for glowing agogos. Rondo, I want you to go there as well. If you find him slacking off, give him some encouragement. Yes. familiar about this place. It reminds me of my home in Tenuto. Ah, what's going on? Well, you see, each and every one of us has a jewel inside our hearts. A jewel? That's right. And that jewel is called an Astra. In some people it glows very brightly, and in others not very much at all. Nevertheless, everyone has one. Do you think your Astra is glowing, Polka? Um, well, there were some cookies I ate without asking you, so... Maybe mine's not glowing. I'm sorry. Ah, so it was you that ate them. But you told me the truth, so it's all right. I'm sure that your Astra is still glowing. I don't know. I'm kinda worried. Hey, Mommy, do I still have time? If I do a whole bunch of good things, will it glow even more? Of course it will. Then I'll start tomorrow. Oh, you won't start today? Oh, Polka. Your Astra is glowing. But it's glowing far too brightly for this world. It's glowing so brightly that it is unconsciously leading you toward a deep darkness, one that must be illuminated. And someday, the moment will arrive when a sea of unending darkness will lie waiting before you. Oh, how I wish you weren't the only person who could bring light to that deep, dark abyss. If only there was someone else who could take your place, then it really wouldn't matter if your light ever dimmed. Yes, a jewel in your heart. It's called cancer. Polka, what's the matter with you? Hey, are you feeling all right? Uh, uh, it's nothing. I just felt dizzy for a minute. That's all. Well, the mountain air up here is very thin. Perhaps that was what caused your dizziness. Thin air, huh? Now that you mention it, my head has been hurting too. I guess it's just time for us to take a break. My legs are all worn out from all that climbing anyway. I agree. Let's try and get a little rest before we continue on, all right? Led towards some place that must be illuminated? A sea of unending darkness will lie before me? What... what does it all mean? Alright. I don't think it's there, but I think it's in the fireplace. No? Maybe I already got it? I could have sworn I didn't get it in here. I 
guess I did get it. Could have sworn I missed it. I guess there's no score piece in there. I guess I got it the last time. Anyway, coming up is kind of a maze-like area, so I whipped out a couple of sheets I had from, uh, is that a monster? No. From my first playthrough, or the first time I, I played this, because the place is kind of a maze. It branches off all over the place, so some directions here and there so I won't get lost. For some reason the enemies are actually easier in here and they give out more experience too. Changing back and forth like this, we're all gonna end up getting sick. There seem to be pools of magma around here. Let's all be very careful passing through this place. That's more of these weird... Uh, I call them torches, that's what they kind of remind me of, but... Yeah, whatever. There's three of them. See, they do look like torches. I'm gonna send you into a flying spin! Look at that, 2100 for, for beating those three things. Not too bad. This might be a good place to grind. Metronome. 
I'm supposed to jump off that little ledge thingy. Yep, jump off here. Floral extract. Okay, don't need that. Another one of those dragon type enemies. by fish. <laughs> All right, try it again, damn it. You foolish creatures. There we go. The pain you felt in the dream. There we go. That's how you're supposed to do it. Got a spew key. I see another drop off. Okay, there's that way, but I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go this way. Alrighty, jump, jump, jump. And I get a stick. Resonating stick. Yes, but I'm gonna have to go back up. 